Christy and friends are gathering right now to remember and honor a loved one who was killed in a hit and run. It happened at 38th and Franklin, and we brought it to you last Thursday night as breaking news. Right now, our crime beat reporter Steve Jefferson is there live for the vigil and the plea for answers from the victim's mother. Steve. Yeah, Anne Marie, that vigil is going to happen right here at 30th and Franklin. As you can see, this is a busy intersection. Those are his friends and family you see right there. This is where that hit and run happened, where it appears the driver never hit the brakes. It has shattered my family to pieces. Zanetta Smith wants to know who was behind the wheel of the car that struck and killed her only son, 27-year-old Darius Webb. This is one of her favorite photos of Darius. Emergency lights lit up the intersection of 38th and Franklin, where the hit and run happened around 10 Thursday night. A security camera at a nearby strip mall recorded Webb walking across the parking lot moments before. Now, hit and run investigators are looking for a maroon or dark colored Buick LaCrosse with the windshield and front end damage. His mother wants the driver held accountable. Whomever killed Darius, I pray for you. You need to find it in your heart to tear yourself in. My son was walking across the street. Walking across the street. And you couldn't even stop and check on him. Family and friends again here at 38th and Franklin. They're getting ready to have prayer, a vigil in memory of Darius Webb hit and killed at this intersection. If you have any information on that suspect's car or the hit and run itself, you can call Crime Stoppers Anonymously. That telephone number is 262-TIPS. We'll have more on this vigil coming up on the night beat. Back to you in the studio. All 